the emulators on the cell phone for the money over the way because I didn't think any light on the like is there something that will work? I've changed, I've changed, I've changed, I've changed. Why cosplay? You know, for me, cosplay is not about prestige. It's about just expressing yourself. You Having fun. So I've always been in love with Darth Vader and a Sith. So when I do cosplay, I'm going to be a Sith. And, you know, everything I have is store-bought. Yeah. And the mask was handmade, but I bought it from somebody else. Yeah. You know, but I have fun. And when I, I, my favorite thing is when the little kids come up and want to hang out. It's taller than I've made us. Oh, my and God. I How you doing, know boss? How, isn't that amazing when little kids come up and see you? I love that. I love oh my that. goodness. It's like, because they have good parents who have introduced them to Devil May Cry. My uh, I just like cosplaying and dressing up, and uh -huh. my dad kind of forced me to come. Your dad forced you to come? But I wanted to also. <laughs> so, why, Alice? I don't know. She's just, I really love the creepy aspect of the game. It's very Tim Burton y. It is, and I'm a huge fan of Tim Burton. Of course you are. <laughs> I am! I'm like, <laughs> obsessed with Nightmare Before Christmas and all that stuff. And That's I was awesome. like, well, you know, I really want a cosplayer. It's kind of creepy and it's different from what I normally do, which is like happy, like, you know, way out. Yeah, yeah, Austin was very bright and vibrant. This is very dark today. Yeah. <laughs> uh, cosplay, it allows you to take on somebody else's persona for a day. It allows you to have confidence in that character. It allows you to show people something that you love. Toad's a dude. Oh, well, I... <laughs> I'm just kidding. Putting my own personal interpretation on it. I like being cute. <laughs> but I don't know. I just think it really allows you to give like a visual of something that you love and something you admire. I love seeing people dressed up as a character they like. I love seeing people in characters that I don't know. Like, yeah, you didn't know who I was. I didn't know who you were. I love I love finding these things out. I love being like, well, who are you? Who is this character that you obviously love so much that you want to be like that? Yeah, yeah. And I think that's just super rad. I think we have a really great community here for that. I think it's because you love the fandom so much that you're just like, I've got to I've got to figure out how to express my love for this character, this cosplay, this series, or whatever. So as growing up from, I was grew up from Super Mario Brothers. I grew up with Sonic the Hedgehog. So when I started growing up with that, I started drawing the characters. And I said, what's even better? I'm going to dress up as them. That's awesome. <laughs> that definitely, I'm telling you, man. I can, I can go as Delson, even though he's a Comish and Native American. But I pull him off. I don't know how. You see, that's exactly it. I, I'm able to pull off a yellow turtle. A yellow turtle. A yellow turtle. <laughs> option. Who do you cosplay? I would probably want to cosplay Valthier from Final Fantasy XII, but he is like such a beautiful manly man that I don't know. I don't know what she's talking about. I don't know if I could be a beautiful manly man. You can be a, a beautiful gender bendy woman. That that is tough. To, I might. I haven't even thought about that. I might. I might have to do that. Gender bend, man. Gender bend. <laughs> All right. If I can cosplay Delson really bad, you can cosplay someone really, really good. Come on, man. <laughs> Um, I, uh, I really like building things with my hands and it gives you a really rewarding feeling when you build something and see it for yourself. When you look outside, um, you see other people's costumes, I really like that as well and just really like games and shows and... Can you poop in that? <laughs> no. <laughs> Can you pee in it? Barely. <laughs> Damn. Um, like people that come out to cosplay and stuff just love to be surrounded by people who love what they love and you know it's a way to express yourself and what you you like uh, to play or read watch whatever you want you know like I personally love cosplaying because it's a lot of fun I've met so many of my friends this way and just I don't know the people that are in my life right now I've, all, I've met mostly through cosplaying and conventions uh, I think it gives you a chance to be a kid again oh. I oh, think okay. uh, it's a really really fun um a chance to relax a little bit we live our our day-to-day -day lives can get so hectic that yeah. this is a chance to just have some fun and goof off we're about to watch suicide squad and i thought a good couple's cosplay would have been like harley and the joker well this is actually my first cosplay i did it this year really yeah i was really nervous about it i like to talk to people i like to travel but cosplay is kind of a different realm realm it really is but you know, I fell in love with Agent Carter, and I didn't have to wear a wig, which was great. Yeah, you looked so similar. I love it. It works for me, but 
It's really empowering. People are really excited. Is there a gun in your purse? There is not a gun in my purse. <laughs> Does it shoot lasers? No. <laughs> okay. There's lipstick and a camera in my purse. That's about that it. That lipstick is a laser, guys. Don't listen to her. Howdy. <laughs> nice to meet you there, Mr. Newcomb. Hey, nice okay. to meet you as well. Um, I don't know. I think they look up to him for a certain period of time, like since their childhood, and then they just want to be able to personify that. Yeah, I think it's fun for people to just get to be somebody else for a day, too. It's always exciting. So instead of just being who you are every day, you're like, oh, what character can I play? Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Probably because you get to you get to act, you get to play around with costumes, and you get to be someone else for a little while. You get to you get to play, you get to act, and just take a little bit of yourself and play. Um, I really think it's different for other people. I love both the characters and just seeing everyone who does it. I mean, you get to be this person that you're out there, you can be anyone. You can really just be expressive and fun. I mean, it's all about the fun anyway. Who today? Maybe. It's amazing. That's so amazing. How good are you? I hold my own. They probably just like the fun of it and they like really like getting in character and being like their favorite characters and just like trying out something new and standing out of the crowd from like normal people, the normal boring people. They just like to have fun. I hear you, man. I hear you. It I've been cosplaying for about two, maybe three years now. This was actually my first ever cosplay and since then I've done Slenderman and shoot, who else have I done? Slenderman, I've done a couple of um, anime characters, and at least one from God of War. Uh, I'm a black belt in Korean Taekwondo, um, but uh, I didn't want to destroy my actual dough book, so I bought a gi, to, because there is a difference in the Thai zone. So, you probably don't like an exploding nutsack technique. <laughs> Um, full armor Samus, for sure. Really? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I, I'm not great at armor builds, but I want to do, like, her helmet, everything. I want to go pew, pew, pew. We have a deadly duo coming. Your favorite web slinger, your favorite guy with his head on fire, Spider-Man with Ghost Rider.